A massive manhunt is underway in Texas. Authorities are searching for a suspect. He is wanted in connection with the shooting of a police officer. The officer is in critical condition. The incident happened in the early hours of the morning. The shooting happened during a routine traffic stop. The officer pulled over a vehicle for a broken taillight. The suspect opened fire on the officer. The suspect then fled the scene. The injured officer managed to call for backup. He was airlifted to a nearby hospital. He is currently undergoing surgery. The entire state is on high alert. Law enforcement is working tirelessly to apprehend the suspect. Following the shooting, a blue alert was issued. The blue alert system is similar to the amber alert, but instead of finding missing children, it helps locate suspects. These suspects are considered dangerous to law enforcement. Blue alerts are broadcast through various channels. These include television, radio, and digital billboards. They provide crucial information about the suspect. This information includes their description, vehicle information, and last known location. The blue alert system is vital. It helps protect those who protect us. It quickly spreads information. This helps apprehend dangerous individuals. It also serves as a reminder of the risks law enforcement officers face daily. Authorities have identified the suspect as 32-year-old Seth Altman. Altman is described as a white male. He is six feet tall and weighs approximately 180 pounds. He has brown hair and blue eyes. Altman has a criminal history. His record includes charges of assault and weapons possession. He is considered armed and dangerous. The public is urged not to approach him. Instead, they should contact the authorities immediately. Altman was last seen driving a silver Ford F-150. The truck has a Texas license plate. The plate number is unknown at this time. Law enforcement is currently reviewing traffic camera footage. They hope to find more information about his whereabouts. Section 4. The Incident and Its Aftermath The incident has sent shockwaves through the community. The injured officer is a five-year veteran of the force. He is known for his dedication to protecting his community. The outpouring of support for the officer and his family has been immense. Fellow officers, community members, and businesses have come together. They offer prayers, donations, and messages of support. The shooting is a stark reminder of the dangers law enforcement officers face. Every day, they put their lives on the line to protect their communities. This incident serves as a tragic example of the risks they take. Section 5. A Statewide Dragnet The manhunt for Seth Altman is ongoing. Law enforcement agencies across Texas are working together. The FBI and Texas Rangers have joined the investigation. Checkpoints have been set up on major highways. Air support is being utilized to search for Altman's vehicle. Law enforcement is following every lead. They are determined to bring him to justice. The search for Altman has extended beyond Texas. Authorities believe he may be trying to flee the state. Border Patrol agents have been alerted. They are on high alert for any sign of him. Section 6. How You Can Help The public plays a crucial role in this manhunt. Anyone with information about Seth Altman's whereabouts is urged to come forward. Even the smallest detail could be helpful to the investigation. If you see Seth Altman, do not approach him. He is considered armed and dangerous. Instead, immediately call 911. Provide the dispatcher with as much information as possible. This is an active and ongoing investigation. Staying informed is crucial. Follow local news outlets and social media for updates. Together, we can help bring Seth Altman to justice and bring closure to the injured officer and his family.